hello there, my little bunnies. Um, today I'm doing um, a Dollar Tree haul. This is not a huge one, it's just like a semi-small one. Um, <clears throat> basically, some things I got today, some things I got yesterday. I had recorded a huge Dollar Tree haul the other day, and I recorded it on my computer camera. And when I tried to <laughs> go upload it to YouTube, um, it's not doing it for some reason. I don't know. My computer's acting up, so I'm going to have to try and get that one to you. But in the meantime, I'm going to show you this one and some of the things I got. So first off, I got these Revlon nails, um, uh, nail style strips. And these I have actually on my nails right now. And I just want to show you guys because on this hand, these two fingernails, my baby finger and my um, ring finger, um, are broke. And they always break. So I just want to show you that even if you have short nails, you can still apply them to your nails. Um, or long, very long nails, um, which these ones never seem to break. Okay, so this is um, almost like a blue with like pink, black pink splash, I guess the style is. Um, not really my favorite, but um, I wanted to try these because I've tried all of the nail strips, like no name brand to Maybelline to Sally Hansen, and by far my best are Sally Hansen. They are the best. But as I put these on, I'm kind of noticing that these might be really comparable to the Sally Hansen. Um, all the other ones are more or less like nail sticker strips. These ones are more or less like real nail polish strips. They actually even smell like nail polish. So I'm hoping these turn out just as good. And this is the first time I was able to find the Revlon in the Dollar Tree. So I'm glad to have tried those. Um, also, I found this pair. And they are so pretty. It's like a cheetah print, and they are like a green glitter. They're really pretty. Um, I also found this, um, lip pencil, um, this is a retractable lip pencil, and it is in dark red, and these actually remind me of the e.l.f. Um, retractable lip pencils, um, I hope it works really well. I got a few garbage items in here that I opened packages up. Um, yes, yesterday from some of the stuff. Um, I also was not able to find anywhere the New York, um, NYC, uh, New York Color nail polishes, but at this specific Dollar Tree they had them, but this is the only one I got. They had other colors. This one is in Midtown, two four, uh, number 240, and it's a really pretty pink color, and it's kind of like a marble pink, and I really like that. And the reason why I didn't get all the other ones is because I have, like, probably, like, 200-something nail polishes, and I just didn't feel the need to get any more. Um, also, I found this um, Alani Lip Gloss, and the color is in Sheer Dark Honey, and I don't know why they call it honey, but it's Sheer Dark Honey, and it actually came in this package here, but I opened it up. So, it's really pretty sparkly color. Very sparkly. And also, I bought these Band-Aids. Um, yesterday was my two-week checkup um, from my surgery. Um, I don't want to keep rubbing this into the videos every time I talk to you guys um, about my ectopic pregnancy, but I had one of my wounds, I know, so gross. It kind of opened up like one of the stitches was coming loose, so um, I wasn't sure if the doctor was going to sew it back up or not, but he said it wasn't necessary, so just put some antibiotic on there and um, some Band-Aids. So these Band-Aids work really good. Most of the Dollar Tree brand Band-Aids that I've got in the past, they're not very sticky. They come off easily, but these fabric ones are really good, and they're by Next Care. Also, I found this... Um, phone charger, and it's, well, it's a USB, um, you can connect it to um, a wall phone charger or a car phone charger, and you guys got to be very careful because when you go in the Dollar Tree, you'll see them, and they all have the Android connection on them, but to tell you the truth, they're not all the same size. 
So what I did to make sure is I took this part and I literally like, let me see if I can show you. Sorry guys. I literally like poked it through the plastic like that and I plugged it in my phone. That way I wasn't opening up the package but I kind of cut through it with this end. And this one fit, but there was another one that didn't, that was too small. So you want to check them out before you just assume that they're all the same. And also, um, I got these lip glosses by LA Color. LA Color been really doing their thing with their new casings and packaging for their lipsticks and lip glosses. I was really impressed with this one. I had also bought recently, if you guys see my other tutorials, some other lip glosses. They were the swirl ones. And <clears throat> this one is in color Cutie, and you get two lip glosses. And yeah, so that's the look of it. Um, also, I got another pack. It's the same packaging, but you get these two. And one is a fuchsia pink, and the other one is like a Barbie doll um, pink. And I want to tell you right now, these, oh my god, I wish I would have grabbed more. The pigment on these are so amazing. They're not clear with the little color in them. It doesn't fool you from the packaging, and then you squirt it out, and it's different. It is the color it shows. Now, this light pink one right here would be too light for me. It kind of makes me look ashy. But this one right here is absolutely beautiful, and I can't wait to open up the other pack and try it. Plus, on top of that, they're super, super buttery soft. They're not sticky. They're not too thick. They're not too thin. They're just perfect. So I really like these. Good for you, LA Colors. Also, I found this NYC um, um, eyeshadow, and it says um, City Duet blendable bright eyeshadows. One is a highlight and the other one is a contour. So the yellow is a highlight, the green is a contour, and this is the first time I've seen this specific colors. So I really like those. I'm going to try them out. Also, I had purchased, oh, I wanted to show you guys this. I had bought this in my last tutorial, and I don't know if you guys have ever tried these. I've seen some people haul them, but the ones that have not tried them do not buy them. They are crap. They literally do not take off your nail polish. I don't know what the heck this is made out of, but it don't take off your nail polish. So I would not recommend these at all. Also by NYC, I found it in the pink and the purple, and one is also a highlighter, and the other one is a contour. Um, yeah, so, and this is in color. Let's see if it tells me. It just says includes dual-ended applicator for professional results. It does not say the actual color. So, um, Also, I purchased some of this um, triple antibacteria um, ointment, and this is also for my incision. Use that before I put my band-aids on. Also, some of these, which I opened them up, are the dental floss picks, and this is my third bag. I really like these. They work excellent. I like them better than just the regular um, dental floss string. Um, it says promotes healthy teeth and gums, so I really like them. They're, I love the fact that they're singly wrapped, so you can throw them in your overnight bag, your purse. Um, whatever, and when you're going out to eat or something, you can go ahead and floss your teeth. But they, I really like these, and you get 30 in the pack. Might be not the garbage left. <laughs> um, my husband also purchased these antibacterial wet wipes for me, and he figured I could use these to kind of wipe around my incisions a little bit. But I'm kind of afraid to use these. I have to read them and see if there's any alcohol in them. But they're supposed to be antibacteria, but it might not necessarily be for my incision, so I don't know if I'm going to be using that. Also, I don't know if you guys have seen um, 
this five minute um, teeth whitening kit and you also get a mouth guard with it. Um, a lot of people were buying these from Walmart um, like last year or something and they're like five bucks for the pack and you can get these at the Dollar Tree so and they really do work. I really do like this whitening. I also want to show you guys these. Um, I am not sure where I purchased these from. I just had to show you guys because these are amazing. Um, I wish that all nail polish companies, don't worry my nails, I got makeup under there. Um, I wish that all Dollar Trees um, sold these. I mean, sorry, I mean, <laughs> all nail polish make these, um, their nail polish like this because these nail polishes are the most smoothest non needing to put double coat on nail polishes I've ever used. They also have sprinkles on top, so sparkles so you can um they're called paint and shake. So you can shake the sparkles on there. But I love these. If any of you guys know where to buy these, please tell me because I cannot remember where I bought them for my daughter. Okay. Moving on. Also at the Dollar Tree I again um got two of these. These are the Lime Away, so these are a name brand. These are not a Dollar Tree brand. Um, these are probably four to five, maybe even more dollars anywhere else. And I'm so excited that the Dollar Tree got them, and I probably will grab as many as I can next time I go back. Because a lot of times when the Dollar Tree runs out of stuff, they don't get it back. So I would be quite disappointed if I miss out on that. So I'm really excited about using this. I actually did use this, sorry. My daughter used it to clean her, um, her toilet up in her her bathroom toilet, and um, she it, it it was awesome. So I grabbed two of those, and then I also bought these here, and I love these. They are so good, so cheesy, rich and creamy is is right. They're by Betty Crocker, and they say you get 20% more. And I like the fact how you get the box tops on them. That's really cool, so the kids can take those to school. Um. These are made of real potatoes. They're American 100% grown potatoes, and they are so good. So I bought two boxes of those. And then I also bought this lunch container for my daughter. I'm probably going to go back and get myself one um, so she can take this to school for her lunch. Um, <clears throat> Sorry. Um, they have them in all colors, pink, blue, green, um, and I think purple. And as you see, there's two compartments in here. One of the compartments, it got plastic wrap on it, guys. One of the compartments is pretty big, nice size for, like, salad or sandwich or something. And then you can put your dressings or sides for your sandwich or hamburger or whatever on this side. And if you take a salad or something like that, I like the fact that they give you a fork and a knife. It would have been nice to have a spoon, but I guess they couldn't fit it on there. And then it has a nice colored top. So I really do like this. Um, it doesn't say, the, oh, does it say the size of it? Yeah, it's 46.5 fluid ounces or 1,375 milliliters. And it is a three-in-one. Also, I found these. I've seen two people hauling these on Facebook. Or one person, sorry. And on Facebook, why do I keep saying Facebook? Um, YouTube, and it looked huge in her hand, but a lot of times I've seen things and they look so big, and then you get them and you go to the store and they're very small. But I want to tell you that this is the biggest container that I've seen um, the Dollar Tree have. It is huge. And I got two of these, and they have them in all colors as well, like pink, blue, purple. Um, I think they might have fluorescent green. And this size is, okay, it doesn't say the size on here, but this is a huge basket, y'all, so I hope you have a lot of stuff to put in here because it really, truly is big. Let me see if I can get a, it's big. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what I got from my Dollar Tree. And, oh, also I got these headbands. I got this one, and then it came in a two-pack with one that's about, it's a royal blue. I actually have it in my hair right now. So um, it is a royal blue. So it came in a two-pack. So that's what I got from the Dollar Tree. Um, I have to swatch this because I have to show you guys the pigment on this. I cannot get off this video without showing you. Let me see if I could one-hand this. I 
I am so anxious to show you guys this. Hold on. Let me... Look at the pigment on this. It's amazing. There's like no clear to it. It is glossy, like shiny, but look at the pigment on that. It's amazing. And I'll show you the pink one as well. And just so you guys don't forget, this is what the packaging looks like. So when you see them, you know that that's it. Okay, and I'll show you this pink, this Barbie pink color. Hold on, y'all. Look at that. They are so pigmented and creamy. They're really nice. But that pink one makes my look, my lips look ashy, so I will not be using that myself. But and I can't give it in the giveaway because I did try it on. Sorry. Alrighty, y'all. So that's what I got. Um, if you guys want to see any more um, swatches, actually, I'm going to go ahead and swatch this crayon real quick. Because I want to see if this L.A. Color Crayon reminds me of the um, the Elf one. Ooh, that's buttery. It glided on like, oh my god. Let me see the pigment. Oh, it's really nice. Ooh, I'm, L.A. Color is doing it, man. They're doing it. All right, y'all. That's all. Oh, you know what? Sorry. I'll swatch this as well, this Milani. Um, lip gloss. That's right there on the corner of my hand. Right there. Uh, it's alright. It's pretty sparkly, but I love them colors. Okay, you guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed my tutorial. Stay tuned for the next, and I'm going to try and get that video uploaded for you guys because it's a pretty cool one. All right, holla. Girl, bye-bye.